Hi, thanks for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to show you the best way to clean your rolling two ply mesh heads. As you can see, I've already cleaned the snare, but now on to the yellow tom toms and those dreaded white dots. I thought before we started cleaning them, you'd get a better idea of the yellowing on the heads against a white towel. Here are the 10 inch heads. And here are the 12 inch heads. There you go. Now, let's get started cleaning these things. First thing I'm going to try is Dawn dishwashing liquid. I know it's in a palm olive container, but forgive me. I'm going to use a towel to put underneath the head so I don't pinch the bead and crush it by any way when I'm scrubbing on top of it very lightly. You see, I'm using a blue kitchen sponge, I'm using a scrubbing side putting it a little bit underwater. I'm not really liking it. I'm seeing like it's a little bit cleaner than the yellowing on the other head, but not much better. We'll try a little bit more effort and just to see if we can get rid of any of that. It's not too bad. We'll do the other one. Put a little bit once again. A little bit more effort into this one. See how that looks. Not too bad, but I'm not real happy. So I think I'm going to move to Barkeeper's Friend. Yeah. For those of you who haven't used Barkeeper's Friend, it's kind of a powdered cleanser, very soft on things. A scrub on that, scrub, scrub, scrub. Still not getting that white dot out, which means it's not getting back to pure white. There it is, the dreaded white dot. So, I'm going to move to Mr. Clean. Clean green. Mr. Clean, yeah, baby. I mean, I know I might sound neurotic on this whole white dot thing, but you got to realize that if I can still see it, then the heads aren't clean enough. So I've got to get rid of it. And guess what I found out? Mr. Clean does. It cleans it out. The final one. There it is. Watch. Bada bang, bada bang, bada bang, and there we go, ladies and gentlemen. I have cleaned the Roland mesh heads. And the winner is Mr. Clean. Green Mr. Clean. Yeah. All right. Let's move on to the rinsing. Quick rinse. Lay it down. Get that water out of the bead. Stand it up on its edge. Let the water run down. Get the water out of the bead. La da 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 da. Onward, onward. There we go. All four. Thank you very much. All right, I got a fluffy towel here to dry it. Just kind of blot it out, clean around the bead. And when you get finished, hold it up to the light. If you don't see any liquid in between the two plies, you know you're good to go. Does it feel nice and dry? There you go. No white dot, nice and dry. Onward. Let's clean the next one. La la la, la la la, la la la. Thank you very much. Hold it up. Look, no white dot. And the next one. Onwards till we get all four over and over. Yes, hold it up. Check it out. See, I'm going to bang this last one here and see if any water comes out of the rim. Hold it up. Look, no water. I'm clean and green and ready to go. No white dots. Thank you very much. Let's jam kids out. 